Hi, my name is Teresa Bloomer, and um, I came in here um, to seek treatment for complex pain regional syndrome. Um, I have several autoimmune diseases and an osteoarthritis and a minor traumatic brain injury and a couple of other things. Um, I have been going through this pain for about five or six years now. So I came in here for complex pain regional syndrome. I was um, on a bunch of different medications, um, which was helping, but I felt like I was completely clouded by the medications. Um, so I didn't feel like I could live without the medications, but I also was having a hard time feeling like I could live on the medications. I just felt very disconnected. Um, from my life and from my myself and um, I had a lot of medication side effects and um, it was hard for me to even plan going out of town um, or to, to plan my day because some medications I was taking I couldn't drive on I have a child um, and the treatments I was doing before this um, they were helping I just felt like a slave to them and I just every day it's like I was on so many medications I couldn't even count. Life before medications was hard, life on medications was hard. I um, was in a really dark place with my disease last year and was looking at other options because I wasn't really sure that if I even wanted to be here anymore. Um, I felt like a burden to my family, I felt like a slave to medications. The treatments were making me feel clouded and disassociated um, from my life and I just wasn't happy off the medications and I wasn't happy on the medications. And I've um, got the stem cell about a month ago <laughs> and within three days um, I'd had a back surgery that was scheduled. Um, and I put off the back surgery to have the stem cell and I kind of thought, well, I'm going to be using a cane for the next, you know, year while I'm working on the stem cell thing. Well, to my surprise, three days later, this pain that I've had in my neck that I get the nerves burnt off for every year um, that I was getting ready to have the surgery for again, it's gone. <laughs> and I wasn't throwing up. And um, this, I still have neck pain, but it's manageable. It's manageable and within days I was starting to um, wanting to, to, to walk with my kid and play with my kid instead of having to endure it which is kind of how I've been living my life moment by moment I'm having to endure things instead of enjoying it and being present either I am clouded by medications or I'm clouded by pain and um, I have my body is starting to like reject all of the medications that I'm on like the things that I was on before like my body doesn't want them and I've started out with a list of medications about this high and I'm going down and down and down I have fingernails that are growing I haven't cut my nails in like a year and they're healthy and the pain in my body is just diminished and I am not on a bunch of medications and this is only a month in. Um, I also have severe allergies um, and it's allergy season and for some reason I am not using an inhaler and I'm not using um, allergy medicine. I don't know if this is a side effect of the stem cell as well but um, uh, I've had improved um, bowel movements and um, I'm just, I can, I, I can be medication free. So what led you to stem cell? I was tired of being on a bunch of medications, and I was tired of being a slave to medications. I was tired of medication side effects. I just felt very disconnected from myself, and I felt a lot of um, chemically induced depression from meds, and I felt like the whole world was going around me, and I just wasn't living my life, and I was just so disconnected from myself. And then right now, I'm on less medications, it's like I enjoy the sun on my face, I can feel the breeze, and these are all things that I was just not noticing before because the meds had me so just numbed up and I'm feeling life again and it's beautiful and I'm only a month in. I'm 
don't know where I'm going to be a year from now, but I kind of feel like a little caterpillar turned into a butterfly, and I feel this metamorphosis going on inside of my body, and this change every day I wake up, and I feel better. I mean, before the stem cell, I was setting my alarm an hour early to wake up before everybody so that I could take the medication so I could get up and take care of my family. Since the stem cell, that is not happening at all. I am not waking up an hour early to take medications to take care of my family. I'm rolling out of bed. I'm not perfect, but I'm not having to run to the medicine cabinet so I can take care of my three-year-old child. And that is amazing. And I just, it's a sense of freedom that I haven't had before. I do. And how was the procedure? The procedure was really, really easy. I think the, the instruments looked a little more scary than anything, but in comparison to what I deal with on a daily basis with pain, it was absolutely nothing. They numbed the area really well. Um, they took the fat out. It was, it was relatively pain-free. The incisions was very small. Um, the recuperation process was, was extremely easy. The staff has been amazing and wonderful um, and very caring. They have contacted me on a very regular basis since the um, stem cell to see how I'm doing. I, you know, I didn't walk away feeling like, well, here's your stem cell and here you go. Like, I just, the staff here has been amazing. And what would you say to potential patients to help them understand how amazing stem cell is? Or what would you say to them? What would be your message? You have to try this. There is absolutely nothing else in the world that I have tried that has been like this. I am striving to be medication free and this is the way. And if you, if you work hard and you want to get off the medications, I think that this is the way to go. And this place has really given me a lot of hope.